Hallo Leute, ich heiße Trina, bin 26 Jahre alt. Ich komme aus den Philippinen. My name is Trina, I'm 26 years old and I'm from Philippines. And I'm one of the video creators here. Feel my vlog, which is the Filipino slash Germany. So, kaya nga gumawa ko ng video dito dahil maraming nag-aasa akin kung ano doon mga requirements needed for Schengen Visa. Take note, way back to 2022, unmarried couple visa yung tawag nito. Ngayon is tourist visa na. So, 2022, I applied in Schengen Visa unmarried couple under unmarried couple visa kasi nga because of the pandemic. But now, they changed it to tourist visa. So, same pa rin yung mga requirements sa unmarried couple visa and sa tourist visa. Kaya, if you're a Pinay na merong partner sa Germany and you're still stuck here sa Philippines but gusto mong pumunta ng Germany, girl, this video is for you. Or if you just wanna go to Germany, kung stuck ka pa rin kung anong agency ang kailangan, mm, no need agency kasi kaya kaya mo na to. Just follow all the requirements needed for sure na approve ka na sa German Embassy. But of course, don't forget to like and subscribe before we will start. Anyway, I think you just like and subscribe already. So, what are we waiting for? Let's begin! So, this is the visa checklist. First is the original passport and one photocopy. Don't forget to photocopy also yung mga stamp just in case nagka-Schengen visa na kayo before. Next is two current biometric passport pictures. Sample po is ganito. And pangatlo is the visa application form. Don't forget to glue the photo in the upper right position and dalawang pages po ito. And don't forget to fill up everything. Next is the proof of relationship with the sponsor. Kunwari sa akin, nag-sponsor is yung father niya and nag-invite is fiancé ko si Daniel. Kaya nag-post or nag-print out ako ng photos namin ng papa niya and si Daniel. And also, take note na kailangan din na meron conversation para nagpapatunay na kayo ay together. Like, kayo ay fiancé talaga or kayo ay friends talaga. So, dapat lahat print out niyo. Next is formal obligation, pero kung wala naman, informal invitation po ang kailangan. Take note of Deutsch and English po siya. Ganito yung sample, dapat nakalagay lahat kung paano kayo nagkakilala. Then this is the example of formal obligation. So yung nag-obligate sa akin is yung father niya. That's why kailangan ko din mag-print out ng pictures namin dalawa. Alam na po ng German kung saan kukuha ng formal obligation. Next is the outward and return journey nyo. So, ito ay ticket lamang, plane ticket. Dapat nakakonfirm. Pero kung hindi naman nakakonfirm, merong mga pencil booking yata yung tawag. 5,000 yung mabayaran nyo sa mga website. I'm not sure lang kung anong website. Tapos, yung visa fee is 4,600 to 48 yung nabayaran ko dun sa BFS. Hindi pa kasali yung 1,500 na babayaran nyo upon appointment sa BFS Global website. Tapos, statement of account. If may statement of account kayo, pwede. Kung wala, formal obligation po is okay na. As long as meron din kayong invitation na. Next is a travel health insurance. You may visit also the page Schengen Visa or sa travel, uh, BFS kung ano yung mga travel insurance na swak sa German Embassy. So for me, ergo po, 55 euro ito. Worth 30,000, I think maximum or minimum yung kailangan sa buong stay nyo po. So kung wala kayong alam ng insurance, you may also comment down below para matulungan namin kayo about the ergo insurance. The next, if employed po kayo, pwede lang COE and approved leave of absent. If self-employed, RTR, bank certificate, etc. And if you're still a pupil or student, uh, proof of enrollment lang ang kailangan. So, other documents, ito ay below 18. Pag hindi naman kayo below 18, no need to comply uh, all these things. So, kung okay na, then you may X the boxes. Take note po, X hindi check kasi ganyan po sa mga German. And of course, do not forget to sign in the signature of applicant or printed name. Alright guys, that's it. And if na-comply nyo na lahat, don't forget to book an appointment sa VFS Global website. So, I will teach you how sa next video na po. So, good luck, will Gluck, und wir sehen uns in Deutschland!